What up, everybody? How y'all doing? Um, I'm doing all right. Because episode five, which this one will be, is not actually episode five. Because when I had originally recorded, I realized far too late that the sound wasn't working. And so it was just like half an hour, 45 minutes of me walking around, talking to myself, and you couldn't hear any of the characters, any of the sounds, none of the wildlife or anything. <sighs> so I'm recording again, and I, um, we're now in an arc or whatever the name of the capital city is. Um, it was literally just 30 minutes of me walking through the wilderness, going through mountain pass and getting into the city. That was all it was. I had so many good clips I could have posted too. I'm so mad about that. <laughs> all right. Well, anyway, um, this is episode five and we're getting back into it. Sorry if I seem a little down. I, I just tried to record this again, and then the freaking game glitched out on me, and I couldn't even start. So I had to stop and start recording again. It was a pain. Yeah, because we had just gotten to, um... To Ark, yeah. I was right. Alright, what am I doing? Meet Jespar. Jaspar and I arrived, safely reached Ark, the jewel of the heartland, and the biggest city of on Enderal. I should meet him at the marketplace when I am ready to, for having my fever examined by his employers. All right. Within Ark, you may also use the signpost to travel back and forth between different districts. To do so, just walk in front of signpost and interact with it. Oh, okay. My sir, do you have a moment? I think the two of us could do business together. All right. What do you need? Well, it is actually quite simple. But since you were kind enough not to just ignore me and walk by as the others did, I would like to share my gratitude for that first. You travel a lot, don't you? Ah, uh, sure. I can tell by the mud on your boots. Here, one of these books might come in handy on your journeys. Which one do you prefer? Crafting, handicraft, enchanting. Um. Handicraft seems useful. Splendid. Say, would you happen to be interested in earning yourself some more coins? Or, even better, more books like those? There is something I need help with. Alright. Uh, I might. What's troubling you? I have a problem. And this problem is called Celia, which happens to be my sister. Alright. Where should I start? You know, I am one of those people who wasn't given everything by fate. Quite the contrary, in fact. When I was a child, the village I grew up in, Foamville, was ambushed by bandits. And both my father and my mother died during the attack. That's rough. My condolences. Believe me, I wouldn't tell you this if it weren't necessary. Fact is, my sister and I dealt with this event differently. We managed to flee the attack and make it to Ark. Where the guards, of course, threw us into the Undercity. But while I tried to honor my father's heritage by using the little I could from our savings by setting up a business, she preferred to wallow in her misery. Don't tell me he wants me to kill her. She got to know the wrong people and has, since then, never done a single bit of honest work. Frankly, she's a dust addict. Day and night, she does nothing else but rot in those drinking holes in the Undercity and blows what little money she makes on her drage. Now, of course, she is still my sister, so all of these years I paid her rent so she doesn't have to sleep on the streets. However, things have changed. Recently, she started using our father's heritage to pay for her addiction, and I will not accept that. Uh, let me get this straight. She blows your money on to buy droge? Well, technically it's our money. Basically, it was a share our father had in a small business here. He was so proud of it, you wouldn't believe it. Luckily enough, I managed to save that paper from the bandits and turned it in at the bank a few years ago. 
after I realized how valuable it was. Since then, it has turned into quite a formidable sum. Nothing huge, of course, but enough to save my business from bankruptcy. All right. You understand? In theory, it is our money, but without me, she would probably have sold it for a bottle of ale. And I won't let her spit on our father's heritage that way. All right. I see, and why don't you just talk to her? <laughs> oh, believe me, I did. Which is why she simply hid the key to our safe in the bank somewhere that I couldn't find it. So, long story short... Okay, this is, this is going in a completely different direction than I, I thought it would. I want you to get her to give me that key. How you do it is up to you. But if you succeed, it won't be to your disadvantage. Fair enough, I'll help you. Where do I find her? Anywhere there's rats and dust. But she spends most of her time in the false dog in the Undercity. One of those dumps I told you about. Just come back to me once you've found something. Alrighty. Let's do that. I want to I wanna do a side quest. Foreign quarters. This must be the marketplace. Oi. You there. S stop ignoring me. What's your problem? You bloody flood your eyes on me, woman. Huh? <laughs> I, uh, you, you think I haven't noticed, don't you? You, you say sorry I want, so I'll, uh, I'll smack your mouth. Your woman? Who is she? <laughs> oh, that you'd like to know, huh? So you can, you can deduce her, me Bernadette. Don't bloody think I'm stupid. Um. Sorry if I offended you somehow. I don't want any trouble. Well, you're lucky I'm having a good day. Next time, I, I, won't, I won't let you off that easy. Well, uh, you was having a, an interesting time. Oh, okay. Where are you? Yes? Is there any news? news? Where have you been these past moons? The whole city's talking about nothing else but the Mad Magister. Thirty dead novices. Oh, boy. How could something like this happen, within the Order? I don't know. I'm new to the city and I'm looking for work. Do you know where I might find- where I can find any? News? Where have you been these past moons? The whole no, city's no. talking- This. Huh? An outland, aren't you? Hmm. Let me think. You could ask old Taiwan from Screws, Hats, Odds and Ends Incorporated. He might have something. Or the Golden Sickle, if you're not afraid of hard work. They're always looking for deer tellers. Alright. Is this it? Visit taverns. You can restock, restock your supplies, hear the latest rumors, or simply something else that I wasn't fast enough to read first. Be careful. The streets aren't safe at this hour. <laughs> yeah. It's not as if I didn't tell them that already. <sighs> huh? This... What? You mean apart from frenzied animals, hordes of living dead okay. lurking Neons, through the wilderness and the whole red madness thing? The Nairamese house of the Baden Brusks? Search for Max Niceblood. After faking his own death in Nairam, he absconded to Enderal and was seen at a farm near Ark's Harbor. Arresting him holds the prospect of a reward of 10,000 Nairamese gold coins. No, none. Just be careful when you're outside the walls. Does this look like the face of someone who isn't careful? For defeating enemies, finishing quests, or other achievements, you receive experience points. I'm still not fast enough. Miss no, Sir? Okay, this is cool. It's actually nice having a cool looking city for once, instead of whatever was going on in Skyrim. Walk blast. Walk blast. The Undercity.
Oh, all right. Fight in the dust pit for glory. Uh oh. Oh, this is so cool. I love the vibes. There you go. Thank you. That's really generous. May his light guide you. Oh. As you can see, I have not pressed anything. <laughs> Hello, sir. You are jacked. Uh, all right. I'm sorry to have disturbed you. What's that? I think I made his condition worse. All right. You know what? I give that guy a penny. Why shouldn't I give you one? Oh, thank you. You truly are a good person. Every, everything all right out here? Welcome to the false dog. I hope I don't have to deal with the like a bar fighters. Oh God. Oop, got moves, they got moves, they got moves. Dance, dance battle, dance battle. Your brother sent me. He wants you to tell me where you hid the safe key for your father's heritage. Oh, does he now? Good old Milburn and his silver tongue. Now he has found himself a lackey to do his dirty work for him. Let's make this short. I'll keep the key. No idea what he told you, but it wasn't the truth. Because if it were, he sure as fuck would be here. And the truth would be what exactly? I'm sure he told you about the raid in our village, didn't he? Well, there's one thing he didn't tell you. After those fuckers killed our parents and tried to break into our house, he left me behind. He took all the valuables he could carry and just ran away. If I hadn't managed to flee, he wouldn't have shed a fucking tear for me. But since fate was so kind to me, things turned out differently. I made it out alive and walked all the way to Ark where I thought he was. So, you'd think he was glad to see me when I found him in these tunnels, wouldn't you? Well, you're wrong. He let me sleep in the room he paid for from our parents' money. And maybe he feels a privilege. And guess what? That hasn't changed until today. Yes, he pays for my room in the barracks, but that's about it. Um, I see your point, but if Mulbert doesn't get access to the money, he will have to close down his shop. If so, you'll have to sleep on the street. <laughs> Worth it. It has been far too long since this asshole has seen the mud of the Undercity. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, this is the type of situation where I might, might have just backed out and been like, all right, bro, you're on your own here, but these options are, uh, uh, <laughs> now that there's no music, this is so awkward. <laughs> Look, I promised your brother I would help him and I keep my word. Just give me that key and then we'll see. Are you deaf? I said no. Oh. But obviously I need to put it another way. Ah! 
I feel like as someone who's wearing heavy armor, I should definitely have the upper hand here. Which I think I do. That's cool. What was I just called? Alright, that got awkward. Foreigners. I don't like the look of your face. Ah, uh, Anderal, the land of the plenty. A new beginning, said our one friend before he got killed on that boat. I just realized that these rats or whatever, they're just skeever models that are like super duper small. It's freaking awesome. Marketplace of the Inner City. Oh, okay. Got a little too excited there. What an amazing loading screen. Stonewell Theater. The Stonewell Theater. The Shrouded Pathless. I heard whispering. Huh? A sun child, huh? Word of advice. Don't go sauntering about dark alleys down here. And watch your pockets. Thanks for the advice. What is it, sun child? If I were a steel crab, you'd be in handcuffs already. I'm looking for knowledge. <laughs> Fair enough. Maybe there's a trick or two I could show you. But trust me, they don't come cheap. Ah, I see. Okay. Well then. Have a good day. This place. People just don't know their path. Hello, oh. Uh, hello. Bandit and a bandit. All right, sunshine. Stop right there. Hand over your money, and we might let you live. Play the hero and. You fill in the blanks. Hundred pennies. Um, color me impressed. I'm almost scared. What the? Do you know what this is? A knife. And trust me. Bro, do you see what this it is? <laughs> it's freaking iron armor. You're not gonna. I did not pay attention to what you said. Did a glitch. We having a stare down right now? I think it glitched, all right. Oh, things just can't go easy, can they? The Blood Moon Riot, starring Jerno Del Merrick as Keeper Artoris. That sounds cool. Alright, 
Alright, we'll save here so I don't have to walk all the way over there again. Alright, sun child. Stop right there. Hand over your money, and we might let you live. Play the hero and well, you fill in the blanks. It'll be impressed. I'm almost scared. What the Do you know what this is? A knife. And trust me, you don't want to see it up close. You heard my friend, so shut up and pay. You want to get out of this alive. Um. You don't look like cutthroats. Why are you doing this? Did I ask you to talk? Give us your fucking purse, or we'll make you. Um. I'm going to count to three. If you're not gone by then, you'll be picking up your teeth from the dust. My whole thing on this is I've scrounged so hard for that hundred pennies. I ain't gonna let it go. <laughs> you think you're tough? Huh? Alright then. Let's do this the hard way. Oh. Alright, that could have gone a lot better, I'm not going to lie. I was like, this is going to look epic. It, it did not look epic. Mainly because I accidentally pressed caps lock. So I wasn't really walking around that quick. Hopefully there's not another fight waiting, on, waiting for me on the other side. How many pennies do I have? At 300 pennies. Okay, I really don't have much to give then. Alright, where's that? Okay, just a little bit further. Huh. Oh, wait, what's that going the right way? Excuse me. No, I have to go. There, there we go. There we go. You look scary. Sleeper. Why are you stopping? Okay. What? What do you want? Do you cock at me? Just, just leave. Blazes! Damn it! This is ridiculous. It's called life, Natalia. Thirty for sheep, and not one penny less. Huh. Oh. Let the flesh maggots have you. Oh, oh Play wow. The path always be even, my dame. I'm getting out of here. Call. Uh -huh. Okay. I should have just given the pennies. <laughs> I'm thinking about it now. I should have just given the pennies. But we live with what mistakes we have. Oh, come on. Come on. Go. Is there like an invisible wall here? Oh, there is. Okay. That explains it. Protection. Then pay. We're keeping our end of the bargain. Now it's your turn. As if I had a bloody choice. 
I'll just pretend I didn't hear that. Of course. Forgive me for my insolence, my sir. He'll have the money by tomorrow. See? It can be so simple. All right, so I guess they're like mercenaries or or something of that nature, protecting people in the Undercity. That's crazy. Oh. And then I think after this, I'll talk to these, to those, uh, those guys, and have them help me with my. Uh, Oh! 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 <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, what was that? Oh my god, I was not prepared. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, what the hell? Obviously, he was not happy for me to be here. Oh, I got stuck. There we go. Nothing of value. Hey, look, a training area of some sort. Penny coins. Penny coins. Arcane rune. Eh. Wait, how much? I could sell that, right? Yeah. The noble quarter. Led by a mysterious father, every dentist in the other city has to pay them tribute or they will lose their protection. Okay. Of course the nobles would have a cool wooded area. Cemetery. Hmm? Huh? Grip. <gasps> Grip. Trigger cooldown or respective talent. Use your shortcuts to switch talents quickly in combat. Okay. What are my talents? I don't play this a lot. What are my talents? Mediation, short period of time. Okay. Monsieur. Monsieur. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> Marketplace, under city. Yes? Oh. I feel like I've just gone yes. in a s circle at this point. <clears throat> oh my god, I am so sorry about that. My chair likes to pop every once in a while. Back to the Undercity we go. My. My sir. Ooh. Ah. Man, I'm tired. 
I did not get a lot of sleep last night. You move slower with your weapon drawn. Yes, I feel like I knew that already. Yes? Yes. I should have just used that freaking fast travel thing in here. Because I have literally just gone in a circle at this point. Uh, under city. Let's go to marketplace. I love the music. guy who I can sell to. Oh my god, it did it again. He looks like I'm a guy who I should be able to talk to. This bloody wench thinks she's about to incarnate. She what? Hmm? Show me your wares. You like. <sighs> I'll get my money back from that. All right. Um, Dagger of Despair, Hunting Bow, Claymore, 13 damage, 13 damage, okay. I've been saving up this stuff for a while. <laughs> Sword, staff of healing. I should have kept that, but it's too late for that now. Um, oh, I should have kept that. Iron. Leather, I don't need that. Leather, I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need... Oh, I should have kept that, damn it. Sometimes like these where you realize that you should just really pay more attention to what you're selling. Scrap metal of an ancient nation. Oh, hey, I got all this stuff right at the start. Shovel, skull, smoking pipes. Spare parts? No, I'll keep the spare parts. Tong stealing. Okay. Safe travels. A safe travels. What is that? Is that like a church or something? Apothecary. House of the Apothecary. Okay. Is that where? Spirits. Oh, that's a pit fight. That would be interesting to look at. Ah! Is he hitting me with frost? Come on, don't kill me. Oh, thank God. What the hell was that? Can be foam bill her. Village. All right, that's gonna take me out of Foamville. This paper is covered with dirt, and a blue powdered handwriting is spidery, as if written with a trembling hand. Some people seem to want more often. They don't want me to know his name. Had an amulet on him. 
probably thought a rancid horror can't read. Ha, surprise, guess he's a novice. Oh, okay. John Snob insists on being addressed as my Sir Darius, wanted to pull me out of my money last time. Poor wretch, blah, blah, blah. Kept looking around. Okay. Oh, wait. that. Take one of those. Alright. Since it wants me to go out to Foam Town or whatever it is, I will not do that. I'll save that for later. I need to get rid of this freaking fever because, Jesus Christ, this is getting ridiculous. Just bar at the marketplace. What? What? You're not one of the relatives mercenaries, are Nope. Oh. That might be interesting in the future. It's been a lot more action-packed than I thought it was going to be this episode. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> Peace weed. Still show. Oh. I'm not gonna lie, for a second I was suspecting there'd be an enemy. Alright. Let's go see our friend Jaspar, and hopefully I can get cured of this fever. Otherwise, I guess I'm dealing with it for a little while longer. Where is he? Harbor, foreign quarter. Oh, yep, okay. I was wondering if that was my eyes or the game. And it's the game. My guy's not having a fun time. Please, Jaspar, please heal me. I currently can't heal. <laughs> and I'm bugging out. Oh my god. I should not have pushed my luck like that. Just far. Just far. That doesn't look fun. Uh, well, look who's arrived. Did you have any problems finding your way around? This right. They're from Ostian. I almost forgot. They're quite fascinating, these places, aren't they? You can climb high, and you can fall just as deep. And every place... Bro, I'm seeing like three of you right now. That's true. Here, put this on. And before you ask, yes, it's necessary. Just trust me. That's it. And why is it Malfas who carries the Sun Temple on his back? Isn't that a gesture of servitude? I feel like how it looks is he's like a pretty boy walking around and he has his friend who looks like he's two steps away from killing over and dying. Just far, please. Please, my guy, help me. A stiff wind could knock me over at this point. So about this fever. Usually those gifted with magic have to report their talent to the order and then 
and pass a ritual that teaches them how to deal with their magic. The journey I recognize the these steps. Game. Once they've passed that, the fever reduces to an endurable level, and new arcanists have their names registered in some kind of holy book. But there are other ways to get rid of the fever. And I hope my employer can tell you about Oh, he's not gonna just give me it? Oh no. I was hoping. Hopefully he can actually heal me, and then I can just deal with okay, it myself. There. I should have just done this first. <laughs> oh my god, why am I yawning so much? Right behind me. It's not far. All right. Just are you okay? You're not looking. Having some pathing issues? What's going on? Why is it so glitchy right around here? Come on, man. <laughs> Plot twist, his friend is the freaking king. Hold it, my sir. No civilians beyond this point without explicit permission. Who are you and what leads you to this holy place? Business. I'm Jaspar Delveric, and I work for the Naramese mages. Ah, oh, right. The mercenary. And who's your companion? Marijo de Luna from Ostian. Esteemed holder of De Luna's Empire of Tender Fragrance, the most prestigious perfumery in all of Vin. Archmagister Marigil sent for him. Didn't he tell you? The Archmagister? Um, well, that does sound like him. Fair enough, he may pass. But show this place the respect it deserves, mercenary. You too, Meister De Luna. You have my word, fair lady. Thank you. <laughs> I just realized I got arrows. <laughs> oh, that's a cool door. I wish my vision wasn't so cloudy. Tomes with teaching spells can either be bought in the Sun Temple in Ark or from traveling Arcanist mages who are not part of the Order but are also not wild mages. This is holy ground. Oh, God. Okay. Well, that went better than expected. Bro, we were like two feet from the guards. Nah, I don't think so. Nobody will suspect someone who's already in the temple. Anyway, I think it's about time I tell you a little bit more about this employer of mine. His name is Constantine Firespark, and he's one of Marath's or Orenthiel's former followers, which the new Grand Master, Teal Orenthiel, brought here by ship about two years ago. That means he's one of the former arch enemies of the Order. All right. They usually wear green, while the Order wears white or red. That should make it easy for you to tell them apart. Fire All right. Spark's pretty much the eldest of Narathsul's mages, and quite well versed in magic, at least from what I've heard. Plus, he's a very gentle and likable fellow, which is why even the Keepers like having him around. Let's hope he can tell us a thing or two about these visions, and help you get rid of the fever. Come, follow me. Huh? Huh? Chin up. It is here that I'm probably going to have to call it. 
Um, I'm trying to keep my recordings uh, shorter than an hour. I'm trying to keep them around 45 minutes at the most. And we are now 45 minutes. I will try and record some more soon so that I don't get back in here and I'm like, whoa, why am I half dead? But anyway, hope you all enjoyed. Let me save one more time. Um, and I hope that you all have a good day, a good week, a good month, and a good year.